Hey guys, and welcome back to Icon UK. It's Layla, and I'm back with another makeup tutorial. Today, I'm gonna to be showing you how to achieve this Ariana Grande inspired makeup look. This is kind of her signature style, and it's kind of my signature style as well. I love this kind of makeup look. If you do wanna see more celebrity inspired makeup looks, then click the eye, and if you do wanna see how to achieve this one, then just keep on watching. So to get started, I'm gonna be applying my Too Faced Born This Way foundation all over the skin and just buffing it over for a nice full coverage. To conceal and highlight, I'm gonna be taking the Maybelline Instant Age Rewind Concealer and just apply it on all the areas I would like to bring forward and make more prominent. To make sure everything stays in place, I'm gonna be setting my foundation and concealer using the Laura Mercier Translucent Loose Setting Powder. And I'm just dusting this in all the areas where I applied the concealer and also with a big powder brush where I applied the foundation. To fill in my brows, I'm gonna be taking the Anastasia Beverly Hills Brow Wiz in dark brown. And I'm just gonna be filling in my brows and sculpting them to look nice and structured. To bronze, I'm going to be taking the Urban Decay Naked Flushed Palette and I'm taking the bronze shade just to give myself a really nice glow all around the skin. Ariana always looks nice and bronze, so I wanted to replicate that. And then I'm also using the highlight from that same palette just to give me a glow on the tops of my cheekbones and also on the tip of my nose. I'm going to go back in with that Maybelline Instant Age Rewind Concealer and just apply it on the lids to act as a primer. For eyeshadow, I'm going to be taking the Urban Decay Gwen Stefani eyeshadow palette and I'm starting off with the shade Anaheim and I'm just going to be blending this into the crease to create a little bit of definition in there. To make my crease look a little bit deeper, I'm going to be taking the shade Zone and this will just make our crease look naturally deeper. And for a really natural matte lid colour, I'm going to be taking the colour Stark and I'm just going to be patting it all along the lid. To create Ariana's signature bold wing, I'm going to be taking this L'Oreal Paris eyeliner. I'm creating quite a thick wing and it's quite an angular wing as well. It turns upwards a lot on the outer corner towards the tail of my brow and this is kind of the style that Ariana likes to go for. For my waterline, I'm going to be applying this eyeliner from Urban Decay just to create a nice black lower lash line. To give my lashes some extra length, I'm going to be applying the Ardell Wispy Lashes and I'm also going to be applying my L'Oreal Paris False Lash Sculpt Mascara to make my natural lashes blend into the false ones. And then for the lips, I really wanted to go for that really pretty pink mauve shade, so I decided to go with MAC Well Lip Pencil and I just applied that around the lips and also filled in my lips a little bit with that as well. And then to finish off, I'm taking Dose of Colors Liquid Lipstick in the color Stone. And that is the finished look. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this makeup look. If you did, then don't forget to like it and also comment down below and let us know who you want us to recreate next. Also, if you wanna see another makeup tutorial from me, then just click right there and subscribe for more videos of me as well. I hope you enjoyed and we will see you next time. Bye.